Hello everybody, I'm Miguel Sanchez and welcome to the world of blocks. It's been one month and two weeks since our last video. Yeah, when I read the Infinite City Pit situation regarding what's next for the world of blocks, but now we want to get to read the comments of that video. Yes, of the story that was just read by the Pit, by Pit of Endless Disgust. It's about to go wild, people, ladies and gentlemen. What you're about to see is totally not out of your mind. But we got to it anyway. So thank you all for coming and welcome to the World of Blocks. As we're nearing the end of the series. Yeah, uh, we're nearing the end of the series. So get ready, guys. What you're about to see is complete out of this world. So are you ready? Then let's get started. Today, for this edition of the World of Blocks, we take a look at the aftermath of the World of Blocks. Reading your comments. That's right. We're going to... I'm going to read the comments of the Infinity Pit situation. That was uploaded a month and two weeks ago. That was... Which is six weeks ago at the time of this recording. I had to find out what happened after Infinity Sunny Pit left DVR for good. Because she needs to work on other things. But don't worry, we've got this together. No matter what we do, we still have you in our mind. And, yeah. So, go check out that video. I, I read it for you. I'll put that link up there on the top right corner of the screen. So, so please go check out the video watch it right now. In the meantime, let's see what we can do. Hi. And jump right in. Are you ready? Good. Before we do that, credit goes to Infinity Pit on DVR. She was the one who created all this. Yeah, yeah. Before she left TV art to work on other things in her mind. So yes, credit goes to Infinite Sunny Pit on TV art. Thank you so much. Uh, link to her channel in the description below. Uh, here's things, and I, I got some other YouTubers who can help me out. Peter John helped me out with this, and so does Rock Geo O four O seven L. Links to both uh, links to both of these channels will be in the description below. So if you want to go subscribe to their channels, please go jump right out. But for now, we gotta give a quick warning for you guys. Warning. Larry Blocks is a property of Blue Animation Studios, Alpha Blast Limited, and a BBC, which of course is the British Broadcasting Corporation. No copyright infringement is intended. I own nothing. You have been warned. Thank you for your attention and for your cooperation. Now, listen closely to these comments from the Infinite 70 Pit situation as I read it to you right now. Here we go. Our first comment comes from Well B B B B from Well B B B Art, who says, Yay, Infinite 70 Pit is banned! Yay! Through five emoji cons. Smiling, yay, bounce, clap, uh, shake and uh, uh, shake and grin, yay. And, and, and dancing happily. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Yeah, I love that. All right, next comment. Coming in from Bull Bear to Art. She, he says, Thank you so much for helping me realize that Soto was a horrible friend. Well, I forgot to tell you that. Infinite Sunny Pit is also known as Soto Sweet. Yeah, Soto Sweet is the secondary name for Infinite Sunny Pit. Yeah, keep that in mind. Uh, Bull, uh, he also replied, yeah, I feel like the fandom is way better and less stressful without her. <laughs> yeah, you know, my friends, I got Cheerius2300 says, yeah, she commented, I can't believe I live in a, I, I live in a lie for almost a year. F you, Soda Sweet, or Soda BCH. Yeah, I had to bleep out, I had to bleep out, cover out all the bad stuff, all the curse words. It's made so that the channel will become, will be family friendly. We don't, we don't say those words on the channel. So keep that in mind. Moving on. Kirby Crap replied, Take her to the Shadow Realm. Throw Shoda in the Shadow Realm. I know. Uh, Infinite Sunny Pit, who who recently left TV art, replied to this. Thank you for this call-out post. I called. I can see everything I've done wrong with perfect clarity, and I'm sorry. I'm going to leave TV art forever and get counseling to become a better person. I vow to never hurt anybody ever again. I promise you, you'll be a better person if it's pit. I'll be proud. We got it. Ivan Corvette. Ivan Corvette commented, This is why I'm scared of her. Next comment, coming in from Daisy Dog 3, who says, Now I know that if it's any pit, it's, a, it's just a stupid jerk who is a child predator. She even lies about herself. Dicey, the weird artist, replied, And I was one of her victims. I really don't like how. I really don't like So Sweet because of her own disgusting actions. Next comment, com next comment coming in from Bronzy McStarburst, who says, I used to support Soda Sweet because I did not mention, I did not know she was a predator of miners. Now I don't. So Sweet is just a stupid jerk who is a child predator. I hope she regrets this and realizes what she did was wrong. And I hate it so much. Uh, Thus, she commented, Thank you so very much about bringing this important topic to the table about Soda Sweet. She's a nasty person, and even if she doesn't know it, and 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 if she and if she doesn't show it, all she needs to get the F out of this fandom and never show her to face again, and never show her face again. Yeah, get them out of this fandom. 
I feel terrible for Daisy and Tundra, who are manipulated by Soda to be her best friends. As for Soda, you are a disappointment to all of us. You're forced to people to you force people to draw N S F W, which is not safe for work. Wait, I noticed that. Uh, sugarcoated some real life topics and made them as a joke, and manipulated your best friends. Leave this fandom ASAP, ASAP, as soon as possible, and get your disgusting crap out of here. Thank you once again for sharing this to the public on DA, DeviantArt. You know, Dicey the Weird Artist replied, I agree with your own fact about how my best friend, um, so sweet, she's actually a groomer who sugarcoated other messed up and terrible things that happened in the real world. I stopped being best friends with her because of her own actions, and she also forced my pal Tundra to draw NSFW in the Aggie, which is not good. And I noticed something with Soda Sweet's behavior too. I also noticed that sugar that she sugarcoated other stuff in her own stories, which I was not okay with. And still remember that time that she looked up R34 of number blocks, and it was so bad, so bad. I can't even believe that Soda Sweet was actually a wolf in a sheep's cotton. And that's why I hate Soda Sweet now. That's too bad. Uh, Little Sheep replied, Yep, I'm just happy she's gone now. I know. Uh, second reply coming in from Dicey the Weird Artist saying, saying, Also, I'm kind of feeling better after the drama ended. Smiley emoticon. <laughs> I love it. Uh, Hair the face commented. This is part one. Okay. Since everyone's sharing, I may just bring my own story to the table. Okay. When I first joined DA, TV Art, I had already seen a few people from the Epi Fandom Wiki website that I have that I have wanted to follow. Epi, me number of Lux, named Marshall, or BS3, and Tundra, or Polar Bear to Art. While I was looking, I came across one of Tundra's many wonderful fan arts and Soul for Soul Sweet series W T A N W. Meaning Welcome to a New World. Notice that. I decided to read some of it, and that's how I became a fan. After a while I consider myself to be just your average fan of the series, reading and commenting Sometimes. Keep in mind that I never joined any live Aggies. Otherwise, I would have picked up my own behavior sooner. Yeah, I know. For part two of this comment, uh, he also commented, Enter last night, where people were exploding over an exposed post, uh, exposed post by Alex. I was absolutely flabbergasted. For a few moments, I thought this was a mistake. There was no way a season member of the MNB community was a groomer. Number blocks, I mean, and that's insane. And how Tundra taking this all in? Dicey, Pio, Marshall, that I saw the evidence, and holy S, yeah, holy S. I was proven, uh, I was proven that she was indeed a groomer, and I used to settle one out in the open, not giving me a single S. Cannot say that, so do it. Not a single S <laughs> as to what she was doing to the miners she was with uh, she was with and uh, she was in that Aggie I knew this that this was a dangerous immature person not only but not only that but also an adult grown-ups should know better thankfully I have been affected by the filthy groomer that is soda sweet but I still can't believe myself and the fact I, that I actually support her I completely disregard her or her existence, and I hope she pays for her actions. I should be more careful in the times to come. I know. Uh, Hither, thanks for the comments. Uh, I love it. Uh, Hitherot, uh, the Don Tosaurus commented, That was a lot of writing, and because I'm a Chinese, it took me 55 minutes to read all the words. Oh, but I agree. <sighs> yes. Uh, Stand Up and Toast Crunchy commented, can you link her social so I can repost so I can report her? She is very disgusting. Even though I am, you know, even though I'm not part of the number one community, I still want to report for sake the, for the victims. She should leave the internet and forever and never come back. Well, Dicey the Weird Arts replied, most of her socials are now deleted. Sad, weird, huh? I know, I know. Second reply coming in from Kirby Craft. Good Evan riddance. How did I miss this earlier? It's beyond me. But I'm glad some of Soda's socials are deleted now. Yes. Did I see that we are in with another second reply? Yep. I know. Me, that's three, commented. So sweet is a disgusting and horrible person. I'm glad these actions have, uh, have come to light and people can know t to avoid her. I had her blocked following the Aggie incident, but never said anything out of fear. And because 
this could be a very uncomfortable topic for me. So, to anyone who has been who has been personally affected by her, I'm so sorry. I wish you luck in coping with this. This must be very hard news to accept, but I believe in you to heal. To so sweet, you are a despicable person and good res to being deactivated. I hope you never show your face to this fandom again and stay far away from minors. It's a bit of a disgust. Thank you very much for writing and supply evidence to help others understand what happened to, any, to anyone else. I hope you understand what's wrong here and take appropriate action. Support her victims, but do not let So Sweet herself have a platform if she ever returns. Mm -hmm. I know. Yeah, it's all my friends. Uh, Dicey the Weir has replied, I'm the person who was who was the victim, victim in this drama, and I know that she literally groomed true NSFW and being disgusting too. Bye. The <laughs> five little shapes, five little shapes, boy, follow, and that's why I'm no longer best friends with her. Yeah, I know. The second reply coming in from me as three. I'm glad that I'm glad you're you're no longer friends with her. All of this must have been very hard on you, and I'm sorry she did all of that to you. I hope everything goes better for you starting today. Yeah, I know. That's when her eyes commented. I just realized the word insanity was in her username, so to mean that she was being a messed up and ill person. I know, and I do not know why I made one commented. This made me. This makes me sick to my stomach. This is a community for a show of targeting towards preschoolers. To see someone doing this s angers me. Ouch, that's gonna hurt. And Lil Shy actually replied, "Yep, I know." Kirby Kirby commented, "A six parter." Here's part one of Kirby Kirby's comment. I used to be in the DM with Soda for a few days ago, and this month, and. I remember telling her. I remember her telling me about this little uh, about this one time she blamed Dicey for letting most of her NSFW content happen in the first place during during one of the Aggie sessions they were both in at the time that, and stated that 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 was the reason why Marshall aka BS3 blocked both Soda and Dicey afterwards. I even remember Soda posting a drawing of her number Soda comforting Dicey after that incident. Tundra would soon chime in as well. Obviously not aware of the dangers, Soda did did get to did get away with it. I guess that also explains why Marshall blocked me earlier this month because he realized I I uh, because he realized I too was friends with that creep at the time. Part two. During I know, I know. during the DM I was in uh, I was in with Soda. She was saying pretty disgusting stuff like how the character of both A and Otto made her develop in her made her develop a her t t tentacle fetish, how she wanted to have a threesome with both set characters, and one time she went to the website Rule Thirty Four in an attempt to look up some number blocks porn, the majority uh, of which are drawn by Jazz Fifty One of all people. I looked up, uh, I chimed in, I chimed in by searching some NSFW content based off a number fanagram, mostly because I was curious to see what the porn of the characters look like since I've heard through a grapevine or two that that people like Jelly and Lee oh, I forgot were being disgusted by the porn that was made for them at the time. Heck even Jay made a community post showing a photo of where we were made uh, were made warning pedoph pedophiles to not uh, to not go Near any of the other uh, any of the other HV email characters in NFG, so that then proceeded, uh, so that then proceed to question why I would even look that up in the first place, which lead me to explaining everything aforementioned here. Even before I turned eighteen this month, I kind of knew that something was up with Soda, but never, but never knew she was always this gross up until Galaxy told me about Alex's post regarding Soda's gross actions she did. Not to mention that early care uh, not to mention early on in the conversation I had her I had with her in the DM that the majority is uh, that the majority of the Neverblox characters have better eyes. Yeah. Yeah. You get the point. In part three it's it's especially scary how Tundra worships the absolute F out of Soda World, out of Soda's World of Blocks series stories since the very beginning, especially with with how much fan art she has made, she has made dedicated to this sort of crap. 
speaking of which, I remember during both the Aggies, I would be I would be in with Soda and the DM. I was in with her all her, with her at the time. She would ask me if I had read World of Blocks. Yeah, not to be fair, I have only read the very first World of Blocks story and thought it was right. But yeah, in retrospect, Soda wanted to, or Soda wanted me to read all of those stories she wrote over the course of her presence online has made me feel, feel pretty sour now. I don't know. We got to part four. I don't know. Don't even try to get me started on how she was able to successfully manipulate Tundra, Dicey, and Ivan to, in, into thinking that everything she did to them, whether they be a victim of her actions or just a casual friend of hers, was 100% A-OK. -okay. That's just such a big red flag for me, for because I'm too, because I too am friends with those said people. It sucks to see the fail, it sucks to see them, the fall for her tricks. I even told Ivan that he doesn't seem to get the memo of how her powerful internet predators like her can be more, can be the more successful they are at gaining an almost cult like following of some kind of based off so kind of based off of the content provided in front of them. And I even showed him a Wikipedia article on, on pedophiles in order to help him learn about why what Soda has done to both Daisy and Tundra is beyond dangerous. No, part five. Of all the content creators that came up as pedophiles this year, from Cosmodor to Manda Pony to Ann Toons to Mini Lad, etc., this case here hit me like a mother F E R. The hardest because I used to be friends with Soda up until Galaxy told me about all of this crap. If I if if it weren't for her warning about if it, if it weren't for her warning me about this since yesterday, if it, and if it is, and if it especially weren't for the post Alex made that kickstarted it all, it would be here to talk all about this to begin with. Closing out with part six, and if Soda Sweet has a chance to read all this, I have something special to say to her. F you, Soda Sweet! I can't believe you you would do this S to not only. Dicey, Tundra, and the many others that have known you over time, but also me too. You truly are the pinnacle of why this community is tearing itself apart day by day with how you were able to get away with what you can. From now on, I will no longer be associated with you in any way, shape, and form. Don't talk to me. Don't contact me. Don't DM me. Just please don't do anything to me and the wise path of stopping eating up everything you have fed them so far. Get the F out of this community. No! Get the F out of the internet in general, you dirty ass whore! Go get therapy. Take some medications. Touch some grass. Just don't come back to the internet, to the internet again. <sighs> For all I care about your relevancy, just at least be glad, or not, that there will soon be a seat waiting for you somewhere in hell. Devil's face. Fire him. Devil's face emoji, fire, fiery emoji. <sighs> thank you for the, thank you for the comment, Kirby Craft. Good to know where I, uh, are you. Uh, Jerry's twenty three oh oh replied to that comment. I was, I was, I was, I was her victims, her f i n dang victim. You know, ouch. Kirby Craft, the Kirby Craft replied. I forgot to mention this, but while Soda was looking up some of the number blocks porn on the Rule thirty four website during the DM, I was. I was in. She explains that it feels good to see Otto Block slash Otto Ice Otto Dog. <sighs> head on uh, head on head. Frustrated emoji. This F ing this F ing groomers, I swear to God. No, oh, thank you for replying, Kirby Cat. We got next time coming in from Ag Year 123, who says best thing I I ever read on the last day of 2020. <sighs> Did I see the weird arts reply? I also stopped being friends with her after hearing that she was a groomer. And Kirby grabbed with a second reply saying, and here's Kirby grabbed with a second reply saying, thank God you were the only victim in this situation that knows how F-E-D up all of this is. Tundra and Ivan, on the other hand, seem to have done the opposite. <sighs> so far, and spoiler alert, 
Well, not really at this point. It's not pretty. I'm very sorry that you had to go through the S Soda has done to you from start to finish. It just saddens me how these types of predators on the internet are able to get away with whatever they've caused so far, regardless of how long it lasted. Sad face emoji. I hope you'll be able to recover from this and hopefully be a lot more better once all this clears out for the new year. Stay safe out there, Dicey. Stay safe. Thank you. The reply coming from Dicey that we are saying, I'm trying to recover from all uh, from all the drama that happened in just 20. Yeah, smiley face. Yeah, I know. Uh, second reply, another second reply coming from Aggie123 who says, absolutely great. The reply also coming from Dicey that we are saying, because she was nothing but a wolf in a sheep's costume. I know. And the fourth reply, the only fourth reply in this video, exactly. The fourth replies are in orange. The replies are in green. Second replies are in yellow. The replies are in blue. And comments are in red. So remember that. Next comment coming in from Aaron the Blue to Artist saying, Okay, me and Soda discussed what age rating was World of Blocks. And she said it was for 13 or 14 years. Uh, it was for, four, for, for 13 or 14 and up. So World of Blocks is for teenagers and older. I know. Alex Echo 38 replied, so sweet is completely aware that any small child can easily browse her content. Regardless, if she had intended for the series to be for an older audience, not once, but not once does she make an attempt to ward very young children off and protect their safety with her series. Secondly, the, those of the age of, uh, of the age thirteen to fourteen are still minors, so this does not excuse her NSFW behavior and split jokes. She has included repeatedly in her series. And it's not safe for work, so yeah, I know. Kirby Crab with the second reply. Not to mention that Soda is 19, Dicey is 12, and Tundra is 13. That, my god, sir, is a very huge age gap. <sighs> the reply coming in from Babu the 555. More like a 9 year gap because I'm 10. Or another second reply coming in from Eric the Blue to Aris saying, I really. Don't know what to say. I have mixed emotions. Hmm, I don't know. Uh, reply coming in from Agnes on cycle 38, who says, Do you even have any proof of that? Hmm, we may never know. Uh, another second reply coming in from Aaron the Blue 2 artist, who says, It was on Discord, but she deleted the server. And, uh, and Aaron the Blue 2 art, mm, and he also got, and he also added, added this reply, saying, So World of Blocks was never intended to be for young children. Hmm, yeah, I know. Uh, hits her. <laughs> All right, hits your Gontosaurus the uh, content. Who is so sweet exactly? Aggie went to the recom uh, re replied, a person that was one of the best, but it turned out she was the worst. Oh no! And now, and now for the final comment of the day, our featured comment in multicolors, in red, uh, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet, pink, gray, and white, indicates the featured comment of the video. The, the featured comment comes in from Alan Seiko thirty eight. Who says, I approve. Soda Sweet has been hiding this stuff for, for far too long. And it was time to serve her play, serve her a plate of internet justice. You know, our final reply comes in from Babu the 555. I also approve. This is exactly the reason why I stopped doing Aggie anymore. The sight of seeing people draw NSFW was disturbing and she was encouraging it. It was sad to see people fall into victim. Even as a minor myself, I see this as bad as disturbing. As bad and disturbing. <sighs> and now you get the point. But that's it, guys. Until next time. That's it, guys. We're done. All the comments have been read. Yay. <sighs> Want to settle it? Yeah. As you, uh, so you know what? The World of Blacks will conclude on its 100th video. The 100th video of the World of Blacks will be its very last of the series. So... Be on the lookout for that. This is only this is only only video number ninety eight series. That's uh, but that's okay. We'll have more coming your way very soon. Only two videos left, and then we're done with the series. So so don't miss out. Yeah. So until next time, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, we'll be back. No, no, we'll see you again real real soon for another exciting video. We got more updates coming your way about the world of blocks. We may never know what's gonna happen, but don't go any but don't go anyway, my friends, because because we have Moshi Monsters by every coming up later on today. We have Trixie as subject for this episode, episode 444. But, and tomorrow on Logo History, episode 369, we'll be taking a look at DC Comics. 
So be on the lookout for that video coming soon, as well as Logo Hussey Moshi coming up coming tomorrow. That'll be episode 19. Be on the lookout for that video coming soon. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching. And if the next sleep story, if the next premiere is a sleep story, I'll react to that on Moshi sleep story reactions. Otherwise, if not, it'll be pushed back to next week. So keep your eyes peeled. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching. Thank you all for watching today. I'm Gonzalez Sanchez. You're really up, and I'll see you next time on the World of Blocks. Stay tuned for further updates as they come in. Whenever we need to know, we'll let you know as the world of blocks. Maybe besides what's going to happen to the world of blocks, we would never know. That we would never know if, if I can find any more information about the world of blocks. I'll, I, I will, I'll let you know and I'll break in for you. So no matter what. So so please stay tuned for it. I'm so sad. I'm so sad that Infinite Sandy Pit is no longer on TVR anymore. She's no longer with us anymore. Recipes Infinite Sandy Pit. You will forever be, be missed. But yes, all these must come to an end. The next last video will be episode will be video number ninety nine in the series, the the second last video in the series. So yeah, it, it might be the end of the world of blocks, but who knows? The world of blocks may come to an end. So yes, as the world of blocks is reaching its final episodes, so get ready, guys. There will be more coming your way very soon. I know. But yeah, thanks for watching. All these must come to an end. Thank you for tuning into the world of blocks. Until next time, we see you all. Because sessions, please remember to. Leave a like, share this video with your friends, leave a comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also, turn on notifications to not miss a new video, please. Subscribe to notifications to not miss a new video for me as we're well on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Thank you all for watching today. Don't forget, Bots Edible is the new character feed to be released by Sam Rio. That we'll talk about, I'll talk about in the most recent episode of Sam Rio Orange is coming up very soon. By the way, the, the series turned one year old two weeks ago. Yes. Uh, June 7th, 2021 was the day that Sam Rio Orange just turned one year old. So, thank you all for tuning in. So, don't miss that. <laughs> I love it. But, anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. We'll see you on Moshi Monsters probably later on today because that's just for, for the World of Blocks. Until next time, guys, thanks for watching. And, rest in peace, Infinite Sandy Pit. We will forever miss you. Thank you. All right, guys, thanks for watching, guys. God bless and happy giving. We have the heart protect you always. And remember, God makes you special and He loves you very much. I will see you guys later. Thank you for watching. Like, fair, subscribe. I will see you in another video. And thank you for tuning in, Infinite Sandy Pit. You're the best. All right, thanks so much, guys. See you in another video. Laters!